Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of The Pesetas here on Shared Moments with Justice. I am Esther Josephine and I am delighted to have you here. So today we have um, our almost resident uh, Perseta on set, mm -hmm. Madam Caro. Yes. Karibu sana. Asante sana. <laughs> I'm really happy to see you. Happy to see you too. <laughs> but you're smiling so, chickly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know I'm smiling chickly mm -hmm. because um, last week we had an episode Yes. Uh, that we talked about um, reproductive health for men. Mm -hmm. And uh, one of the comments mm -hmm. or rather your statement mm -hmm. was that the longest a man can last is seven minutes yes that brought in a lot mm -hmm. of reactions <laughs> <laughs> where what you were like wow okay is this is this supposed to happen in kenya <laughs> we got <laughs> we got mixed reactions there are those mm -hmm. who are like is this this is too short and uh, there's yeah. also others who are like, uh, uh, this that also long. last for like seven minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so it was... <laughs> wow, okay. That was really good. Mm -hmm. And I want us today to react to that. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can now explain further mm -hmm. how the seven minutes uh, is counted and from ah, what point okay. we start okay. counting all this. Right, all right. So karibu sana. Asante sana, Josephine. And for our first time viewer, my name is Carol, your health coach. For our frequent viewers... Tunajuana, Carol, your health coach, naturally does naturopathy health coaching. By mm -hmm. naturopathic health coaching, what I mean is mm. I look at the resources surrounding us and we see how to maximize health and to keep diseases away as we manage what we have. Amazing. And uh, other than that, I am a sexual and reproductive health educator, which has earned me a name, Antiwa Utamu or Tatawa Murio. Uh, other than that, I'm all an author. I run my company called Rejuvenating Nature's Beam, where it's a consultancy firm where we are able to educate more on uh, people on healthy living and how to maximize health. I run an NGO called wow. Health Sister Foundation. <laughs> I am yes. a cancer survivor, and mm -hmm. on for that, I am uh, I have built a pillar for cancer patients. Yes. So. That's you also do run uh, a women's seminar? Yes, 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 yes. I have a women's seminar. It's called a monthly women's seminar called Let Lose Retreat. Mm -hmm. that's, uh, that's where women come in and have a safe space, a place where they can be their true self. And now men have said, we don't want to be left out. They so need we, to be we are thinking about having a platform for women, uh -huh. for men, mm. because for women, all we do is we create a space, safe space. Uh, most people are scared of doing things because of the social media, because of the videos and everything, and people are being judged. So for Let Lose Retreat, we've done it for more than six months now. Mm. And the women just come if you want to cry, if you want to scream, if you want to be wow. happy, if you want wow. to run, to roll on the grass, all those things. That's so genius. So we just let loose. Yes. And so if, if any woman would want to be a part of us, you can reach us on our phone number 0711. Six two one five six three, and we'll tell you the details of the retreat. Great. Mm -hmm. So in interestingly, yes. is that people picked that statement mm -hmm. or that segment mm -hmm. in the whole topic, topic. which was <laughs> it's interesting because you see this. Uh, our discussion was on erectile dysfunction and yes. low libido yes. in men, mm. and how the seven minutes came to be is because uh, anyone we, we were asking is how long should I, when we were discussing erectile dysfunction and the issues because someone with erectile dysfunction they are not able to maintain an erection for long uh, and we you just asked me yes. but how long should one last and mm. that those seven minutes kumbe <laughs> yes. we did not know yes. so um the fact that we the seven minutes came to be that was the it was for part us, of the yes, discussion and it just came. And, and we love that. We love that we were just seeing erectile dysfunction. Yes. We had not seen this other side. Exactly. We had not seen the prolonged ejaculation because that's also another problem. That's a problem. Yes. Wow. And we will discuss that also. Oh, it's that a, also on another episode. On another episode, <laughs> yes. how it can bring psychological and physical effects to the man and mm. to the woman. So all these people who are asking me, what about my, my, my guest last four hours? <laughs> <laughs> when we're talking in terms of minutes, like yes. we're not talking up in terms of hours, <laughs> there might be a problem. Mm. So it's not a reason to celebrate. Actually, seven minutes is the 
average it's a minimum erectile dysfunction is the lowest mm. seven is the norm is the minimum or average mm. uh, then prolonged ejaculation is the longest so the, wow. these are three so mm. we started with the rectal now we will do seven minutes then sometime sometime later we can we do can now look the at the prolonged, prolonged ejaculation ejac yes yes because where well, that, that, that can be <laughs> it is it has psychological trauma and physical trauma to both to people. both part partners yes 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 yes, yes, yes. Mm. but today we are here to elaborate, or rather, give more details of on the, the seven, seven minutes, minutes yes. and where the counting starts from. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. The, please, <laughs> what are we talking about today? <laughs> we want to know. We want to know exactly uh -huh. at what point do you start counting the seven minutes, uh -huh. and we also want to look at um, how do you prepare for you to be able to last those seven minutes. That's Very where important. we'll talk about the foreplay. Yes. Yes. Now, <laughs> to our reaction, Kwanza, a very funny question I got. Yes. You can apply for all the work you see. The seven minutes. But seven minutes is the longest that we say that it can. Yes. But I'm thinking, oh, when I saw that question, I was like, you know, I'm thinking, uh, most people are thinking the seven min minutes uh, it's from start. It's from, what is that start? Actually, yeah. <laughs> uh, actually, that is where I want us to start. What is this start? Where yes, should it start? Yes, yes. Is it the, from? This foreplay? Uh -huh. You know? Yes. Then before now, you get to the seconds, to the <laughs> seven minutes. <laughs> yes. So I had to clarify to so many, many people, people, but guys, it didn't mean at seven, at minutes seven minutes at you from, you know? <laughs> It, 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 that's why it's for play. Emma, correct me if I'm wrong. Yes, that is that is true. And why I've even I was I'm almost rising up when we asked where is the start because sometimes, especially um, if you shy, if you have unresolved issues, if you think sex is just penetration, mm. you run away from the foreplay. And that is a very important and crucial part. Okay. Now, this is a conversation we are going to have as women mm. to educate our men. Exactly. That a woman needs, wants, and appreciates foreplay more than anything in you this world. You need to be prepared. You need to be prepared. Psychologically. Yes. Yes. And I keep telling, I keep, I keep telling uh, men my brothers, we women, I compare us to an electric cooker. An electric cooker, the moment you switch it on, it takes a long time to heat up. But mm -hmm. the moment it heats up, yes. my friend, yes. it is red, red, red hot. <laughs> and men are like gas cookers. When you light it, it is chop, and then you can Instantly. just chop. Yes. Why? Because for men, uh, sex is more, like more physical physical yes, than yes. it is psychological mm. and for us women we need to be taken a step by step our setup is slowly we have we are wired we are, differently we are we multitask we <laughs> yes, can breastfeed exactly. and cook and still do these things mm. but for men they use one side of their brain so it's sex it's just cabinet that's yeah. it mm. erection now it is instant true, instant see, see, we have to go a long way mm -hmm. and so when we're talking about the seven minutes the seven minutes are on the very high side yes from penetration point yes exactly yes. And even even the person who is going who, who is not strong enough sexually to go up to the seven minutes, it doesn't mean if I I feel sad when women tell me that from the moment he gets in he pumps pumps and pumps and pumps and pumps and pumps and <laughs> the seven minutes you can have conversations you can move you can change the style exactly, you can exactly it can extend okay, wait we will come to the details of the this seven is minutes is so interesting. <laughs> Look, we are just rising from our seats. i know i know but let's dwell more on the sex play, on mm -hmm, the foreplay the foreplay. there is the good one mm -hmm. and there is the wrong one yes there's somebody who said mm -hmm. man this girl is going to need Tuning, come on, I'm tuning. Tuning my nipples like I'm try. I'm try put after radio station. I'm not after frequency. You know. <laughs> so I love this feedback. So I and we come on. Yes. How do you handle? Okay. Especially for women. How yes. do we want to be handled? Yes. Yes. Okay. So that you don't even instead of you kush kuwaka. Mm -hmm. You end up switching off more. I know. Mm -hmm. Someone else who told me he he uses his fingers, and I am like, God, what are you doing to me? Are you trying to tear my vagina? What exactly, are you doing? Exactly. It uh, works so, differently for naturally. Mm -hmm. A woman is a gentle soul. We are very gentle, and we want to we want to be 
we want three things. A woman needs three things. Attention, appreciation, and uh, affection. Mm. And you need to give, when you give me those three, I naturally will feel appreciated. Mm. And so I will allow you to touch my body slowly. Mm. One, be gentle. Gentle, there's there's yes. this thing I've seen on TikTok. Mm. A man kissing a bride. Mm, mm. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what was that? I saw that video. <laughs> I think we will insert it. <laughs> why? Why? What, what was, was that? Because so he started by. <laughs> then he pulled her like this and <laughs> then. then it, mm. <laughs> that, I felt rough. pain on her behalf. Me too. Because I was like, this is. Church, this is your wedding. That was what will Jura. happen during the honeymoon? Exactly, yes. you'll be killed. So, women, we want gentleness. Mm. But be, even before I talk about gentleness, your hands must be clean. Please, my brother, please <laughs> wash your hands. <laughs> yes, please wash your hands. <laughs> oh, because God. people. People will be like, no, we're not going to wash your mikono before. Yes, like, why? As if we're going to, wait, you're going to eat. Yes, we mm -hmm. need to, you're going to eat. But also remember, <laughs> yes. your sexual organ is outside. Mine is inside. So you're taking infection. You're bringing me exactly, bacterial exactly. infections. It's very important. And maybe those hands were holding money. I don't know, keys. I don't know what to wash your hands. That's the first thing. Mm. Wash your mouth. Mm -hmm. Brush your teeth. Mm -hmm. You can't come to me when you're stinking. Mm. You cannot. You should not. Because I also want someone who is clean. And for me, I'll be clean as well. Yes. Number two, be gentle. Mm. We get to know where our nerves are. Mm. The most sensitive part of a woman's body. Let me start. By even the hair. This is my nurse. Those who are wearing weaves. Yes. And, uh, okay, the weaves. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Now that Because I've actually seen that complaint from uh, a few online uh, yes. saying it's so hard to romance an African woman because of the weaves and stuff. It's there, it's thinking, it has wax and mafuta and mm. God knows what. Mm. Mm. And, and that's why I, I love this um, Peseta segment when you do it with Rosette, the Sorano Organics. So she's teaching people how to, to yes, do these things and, I, and I really like the, it. Yes, yes, I really yes. like what you guys are doing. Oh, so, thank you. So for, for a man, get to know that a woman's now, where the, the nerves the are nerves very are. sensitive. You mm. see this part? Mm -hmm, this mm -hmm, part. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There's a reason why God put beards for men here. He would have put oh, beards here. Oh, okay. I see where you're going. Mm -hmm. <laughs> So when uh -huh. your beards, when the beards touch here, we feel okay. That okay. one. This is the most and most of your woman's nerves are here. Oh. So start here oh, because know. we love hearing. That's mm -hmm. why we love whispers. Ah. Whisper to me. Okay. okay. That's why we love it because women mm. we are tuned on, mm. we are turned on by listening. Mm and touching mm. men they just want to see see yes as yes. it's then the neck mm. gently go down very our gently. nerves mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. on our breast area are very sensitive yes so you don't have to finya <laughs> yes you know, uh -huh. be gentle be gentle and also men start mm. watching as babies breastfeed mm. Mm -hmm. that is how you should do it the way ah. a baby breastfeeds. Okay. Remember, okay. a baby doesn't have teeth. Yeah, thank you. No <laughs> biting. <laughs> Don't bite me. <laughs> a baby doesn't have teeth. Uh -huh. So do it like a baby. From now, if you didn't know, go and watch a baby when she, when he or she is breastfeeding. Be gentle and mm -hmm, mm -hmm, slowly mm -hmm. and surely, because the nerves around are the there? nipple mm. are very sensitive. Okay. On our stomach, mm. around the navel, the navel mm. is very sensitive. And of course the pelvic area. Mm. I know women love the men men love our behind more than and then of course our vaginal area is very mm. concentrated. Behind the knee. Oh. There are so many nerves. Hapa, You're me making me want to confirm. Yes. So hapa behind the knee and um what, what, what would we call it? Inya uko chini pale ka. Okay, yes. So yes. those are the sensitive parts. Look nice. for them. And mm -hmm. also, engage mm. your partner and ask her, unapana ni kuguza wapi? Ah. Kini usiende kuuliza kama ni 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 fasid, ni, 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 ni yeah, yeah, it be... You see, when you ask me, I feel you want to you want me to be happy. Mm -hmm. I feel appreciated. Mm -hmm. Make it a conversational Make process. Make it a conversation. Oh. And foreplay does not have to be... Uh, 
exactly just before sex mm. for women foreplay can start as far as in the morning mm. when you'll have sex in the evening exactly exactly text her mm. tease her then you know call her tell her some nice things because mm. we like hearing that's yes. why we get married after me ambo na nita kununulia ndege na hujui hata hamna ngai hapo na wewe unaenda tu ndege hata umeenda mbali and we love and that's why we when we find a man with a vision we will fall for him because atatuambia nita kujengea kinyumba kikubwa hapa yes, <laughs> that's what we want to house, hear i'll take you yes. out najua and we're like oh so for play is not necessarily just few minutes before sex it should for a woman it should start kutoka uko mbele kutoka uko. and for our brothers they need to know we need attention affection mm. appreciation nice are there any tools or products that help in uh, making it better mm -hmm. yes yes hapo ndio umebuza sasa so for a woman to be sexually lubricated you see a woman needs um uh vaginal discharge mm. for her to be ready yes, it yes. is an indication first of all before I even go to the tool her, a man will know that her woman is ready when there is lubrication mm. when mm. there are some women not every woman when the nipples will be like this oh okay all yes. right okay. and you can also tell that her skin starts becoming pale her eyes lighten up and the, her, her pupils open up like okay, this okay uh, okay mm, okay ngoja kwanza ngoja kwanza eyes open up do women yes. open their eyes during that moment oh, they yes. close their eyes <laughs> But naturally when uh -huh. you get excited your uh -huh. pupils will just dilate mm. you will start shining and you feel mm, like oh. you see you become a 12 year old like uh -huh. you so become that, so delicate yes, for that to happen you need mm. a hormone called estrogen the feminine hormone mm. and for if it is taking longer especially for the older women you know they've gone through the journey and they're like ah, niki, nini, nini, nani, ambia, nisi, mm. there's the original dark chocolate mm. this one mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it will provide with magnesium get a, just take a bite and it will provide it will start warming up the Ask estrogen for the woman, for the woman. and so even a man so it's good to give your yes, woman chocolate yes uh -huh. the chocolate good 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 chocolate but don't overdo the the chocolate because it has high calories and ah, all this okay. just take a bite even a man can take a bite kiss mm. her with this kajak uh, chocolate you know and for a woman what it does it calms down the nerves it provides magnesium mm. Then boost the estrogen and then helps her calm down. And forget the reason, all those things. That's she the reason was, uh, why you see Valentine's Day people giving them chocolate. I know most oh, men they, have they never don't known know why. why. Yes. But people are given chocolate and flowers. Flowers are to release a hormone called dopamine. Dopamine. Are you for real? Yes. Okay, flowers have that effect bright colors this this bright whenever you see especially yellow orange mm. naturally at hey. the back of your mind hey. you pff. no wonder wakamba eh, as, mm. <laughs> <laughs> i just want to give you another example no wonder when you think you want light skin come away because oh. it lightens up you mm -hmm. you bring out the dopamine mm. so when you see colors and no wonder even when you were growing up eh nyumba ya wanaume their bulb used to have bluish the, mm -hmm. like that mm -hmm. yes, dimish yes. no wonder when you go to um high five star hotels to sleep you'll find a white bed mm. red petal red yes, color petals yes, yes, like yes, it yes. ignites the dopamine wow. dopamine wow. is the happy hormone unfortunately dopamine is not found in most of our foods we can only harvest it through colors when you see happy colors you feel happy okay. and you release the happy hormones where okay another hormone a woman needs for her to be sexually stimulated is called oxytocin oxytocin cannot be bought from the shop or anywhere oxytocin is bought by just cuddling touching her being affectionate and then you feel that's why women are so cuddly and yes. want to be cuddled yes. and uh, so when you have oxytocin and dopamine mm. your estrogen goes high naturally and if the vaginal discharge is not complete completely you see she might be get excited and as we said mm. you will get excited then you you'll remember wala la 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 sikufunga ofisi wa 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 then the excitement will just disappear so exactly. then you get vaginal dryness that's where now the sex lubricant comes in uh, so you can be able to apply and to help her uh, or even during this penetration oh uh, ana ananiambia 7 minutes eh kuna pale tunafika mtu anachoka tu 
lakini hakuambi so anakuwa vagina anakuwa dry so that's where the the the, the massage oil comes in mm-hmm. and you can apply it is safe to it for penetration mm. but uh, for a woman she needs to be excited through and through mm. but i'll tell you one thing and maybe when we'll have a woman uh, the women show i'll tell you in details mm. a woman can only have an orgasm if she allows herself to only a woman can give herself an orgasm mm. shout that <laughs> <laughs> unfortunately i know this will sound very opposite but a man cannot give a woman an orgasm mm-hmm. it's the woman who allows herself if a woman blocks that ata ufanye nini ata ufanye miujiza gani will not come out that is true yes that is true that's I the difference that. between men and women <laughs> okay. men it can just come and there's a difference even for men ejaculation is not orgasm okay okay how yes. is how so men have sex for two reasons when they are under pressure and they need to release it so it's so easy for him to just ejaculate when he's having it for pleasure and with someone he loves it is an orgasm that opens up especially the pelvic area mm-hmm. opens up the entire body uh-huh. and that one gives him pleasure wow hii ingine ni pressure mm. <laughs> so kuna pleasure na kuna pressure pressure na pleasure <laughs> what well, yes okay so i hope we are clear on the 7 minutes mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but please you tell us what you yes, think. How from... long do you last? Maju. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how long <laughs> does your man last? Maybe how labda, long does your man I actually, labda I tunafanya research. Are we using the wrong the wrong Maju? Need to even to do a research. Eh to 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 fanya research. Mtu ambaye. Fanya research tena we can go back to research because We even got reactions from ladies and they're like wait 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 when my my, my dude is abnormal yeah. Seven. Like, what do you mean does this even exist so we got all kinds <laughs> of reactions like you know at least a one minute ah at one minute ni long ni <laughs> long yes <laughs> that has been beautiful and that has reminded me mm-hmm. um is it normal to just have a one good long sex session as opposed to many quality and, quality mm. versus quantity yes 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 one your partner determines if you'll give quality mm. or you'll give quantity, quantity. Mm. your relation your communication and communication i don't mean just verbal there's mm. even physical mm. if the she's responding verbal. if mm. you you know like that you can go for long and give quality mm. but there are others who think it's quantity quantity ni ile um one two Three. Yes, yes. It's not even satisfying. It is tiring. Mm. It is not possible. But for a man after every f- first ejaculation, he ma- he needs to take a break. Mm. Just a small break. But mm. if the partner is if there is communication, he can go once, continue continue until now if you keep hali sasa energy ishe yote kuna pali sasa nguvu is lazima zitaisha tu yes so it depends uh, quality and quantity it depends with your partner mm, and how you are relating mm, and also yes. the quality of the foreplay you yes. know that yes and wow. the environment and the environment mm. is very important yes. Thank you very much. I think I feel like this conversation needs to continue, to continue, and continue because then continue. we can talk about yes, today. at least to tulikuwa side ya wakina dada kama sisi. Yes, yes, so tumewatetea. Mm. Na kama if we have left out anything that needs to Jeez, be done. Yes, yes, yeah, we we you let us know. You will talk to us about for play guys. Eh. How do you like it for yes. the ladies, for the men? What, 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 what do you think works for your woman? And always remember for a man Yeah, by the time he's even starting the foreplay because him he likes he, his mind is already switched on. Mm. He has an erection. Mm. So most of them wakona haraka yeye anataka kuingia paradiso. Paradiso lazima he's in his mind he's like let me just get there. It, it is unfair yes. and it's selfish for a man. Mm. Very selfish. Mm. So when you're doing this foreplay it's also a test of patience. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> let me not let me not okay. <laughs> Yes. So but uh, this is a, an ongoing conversation yes. because there is a lot that we haven't even tackled. Exactly. Even the the choice of lingerie colors yes. and uh you know and what to wear to bed mm-hmm. and all that when you're with your partner. Yes. They there's a lot that we haven't talked about. Exactly. But today it was strictly about foreplay and we want, we just wanted to clarify that the seven minutes is not from foreplay. Foreplay, foreplay can start even from the morning yes. as the health coach has told you guys. Mm-hmm. So and these are not mm-hmm. just words picked from the streets. These are 
best yes, on research. Yes, yes, and these are women who are telling you. And these are women. Yes. I see somebody else saying, let men talk about men issues, but we are the recipients. Yeah, there is exactly. Yes. See, it's as who is yawa. Hey, people. <laughs> Yeah, I, before I even, I, I want to remind men, please wash your hands and brush your teeth. Very important. I think that's very important. Mm. Because, you know, one of the many reasons why I created Happy Vagina Oil is because women are suffering from yeast infections and UTIs. And we will have a show where I'll explain to you why most women, especially the married women, mm. they are coming up with so many UTI issues and the yeast infection issues. It's hygiene issues. It's hygiene and also there is some scientific explanation. Oh. So it's important to say guard your woman just mm. the same way that men are trying to uh, run away from the family planning issues and mm. then it's affecting their wives well, that's another show we'll do about we the family planning yes, yes. and how you can get but today even if you don't do anything else for your wife please wash your hands yes yes Pale bedroom, pale kwa mlango, the first thing should be there, mm. ni maji ya kunawa mkono jameni. Mm. Because those hands are causing so much. Hata kama ni kwa single room, kuna besheni chini ya kitanda. Kabesheni. Kavute tu. Because women are suffering from the UTIs and mm. the yeast infections mm. and other issues that are related to hygiene. And you know, your oral hygiene, HPV, human papilloma mm. virus, can mm. be transmitted from your mouth Gee. to the vagina. Okay. So that's wow. another topic that wow. I will teach you about. Yes, so yes. please, hygiene is very important. It is very important. I think important. even if we don't say anything else today, we've said enough. At least hygiene before sex. Hygiene, yes. It's very important. Yes. And also, please, give your women for play. See, Mamboya. <laughs> <laughs> is this thing niliona niliambiwa na watu wengine ati kuna is someone on tiktok who does uh, anapikanga anafanyanga done done eh done yes done. yes i know it is <laughs> so there are some men who are, there are some men who are doing done done that's so unfair that's so unfair akikaro <laughs> you are making it okay okay i've seen okay. so many comments from women <laughs> saying ah, and I'll be very honest, a woman will hate you for that, by the way. Yes, a I would. A woman will be I disgusted. I would. Ata staki kuwona karibu tena na Yes, yes, yes. Ah, yes Uyo, yes. ni, ni uchafu tu alini paka. Imagine, he, exactly. And, and also remember, I, I want to remind men that if you, you do this too much, remember, our bladder is right next, our cervix is not far. Man, unatumiza. And, and there's also the, the whole friction yes. point, especially when you're not well prepared. Yes. Because one point of uh, foreplay is to, to prepare, prepare you so that you can be well lubricated. Exactly. Otherwise, you'll end up wounding me, leaving good. me with wounds. <laughs> yes. So and they don't know that. And then when you finish that, you sleep and you start snoring. Mm -hmm. Get out of mm -hmm. here. And then in the morning, you're like... Ah, you need better. You need better. Who is this? You know, Jerry. The Roka. Yes. Mm. Okay, okay. Mm. Let's use English. <laughs> Let's use the accuser of being biased. Oh, no, I'm just, we, it's just a joke. <laughs> but yes, I've heard that. Yes. So next time, kindly, let's we talk about talk. women mm. and also how they need to respond. Yes. Because it's also very important. It's participatory. Yes. You need to mm -hmm. particip participate, mm -hmm. both of you. Mm -hmm. You walk this journey together mm -hmm. so that you arrive together. Me, I want to see, um, I, I, the next time we'll talk about how you can make ugali mm. without twisting the wiko. Nice, nice. So uh, let's uh, end it there. Like, <laughs> I, I get you. I, I get you pick very well. Ivi. Ivi. Yes, Ivi. U, 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 yes, very important. Yes. So <laughs> I see my director <laughs> trying to signal me that time is up. Yes. So thank you very much. It's been such a pleasure. Karibu sana. I Asante. Asante. Please, and thank you for we... making it so lively. Karibu. You are full of energy. <laughs> you make it so easy for me. Thank you. Well, Asante. Yeah. Asante sana. So how can we reach you? And get these amazing products. Amazing. So we are R and B. R and B is rejuvenating nature's beam. Uh, you can go to our website www.rnb.co.ke. Else you can make you can give us a phone call. We have zero seven one one six two one five six three or 
0750-621563. We are in Thika Town. Our headquarters are in Thika Town in Wetavia House. Uh, build, Wetavia House is the building that hosts Consolidated Bank. You mm. go to Annex Room 201 and you'll see R&B all the way. Mm. If not that, we are in towns that are near you. We are in Riru Town, we are in Nanyuki Town, we are in Nakuru Town, Kikuyu Town, Kose, uh, Kiserian, eh, Ongatarungai, mm. eh, eh, I've forgotten all the others, Nairobi. But, <laughs> but we'll what we do them. on the comment section, mm. we'll share all the details and the phone numbers. Yes. And then we'll be able to provide not just what we just talked about. There are so many other range of products mm. and you can get to enjoy. I also want to remind our viewer to make sure that they follow me on Facebook, on uh, Instagram, on Twitter, and on YouTube because there I'm able to talk. Uh, I speak three different languages and wow. I also speak it as openly mm. and as real as it can get. My name is Carol, your health coach. Thank you very much, your health coach. Mm. <laughs> Thank you for this. <laughs> Thank you. Too bad for time. I know. I wish we, had more I wish time, we can do a whole it's been day. Amazing. I know we can. This actually can be discussed. Mr. Project, Director, we need to talk it's to been, It's been amazing. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> it's been so much amazing. So remember to follow Carol, your health coach, on her channel. It's yes. Carol, your health coach, yes, right? Yes, Carol, your health coach. Remember, go and subscribe and follow Carol, your health coach, on her platform. Mm -hmm where she talks more about these things and so many other topics related to uh, wellness, general wellness. Yes, yes, And yes. in the natural way. In the natural way and in layman's language. Well, in layman's. Yes. <laughs> I love that. I love that. That's where you get all the juicy details. Mm -hmm. Thank you, our viewers, for sticking with us and uh, for your questions and concerns and comments. We really appreciate them. We will try our mm -hmm. best to yeah. address. Yes what we can address in the best way that we can. Mm -hmm. So, and uh, your health coach is here to answer all those questions. Yes. And uh, it's been such a pleasure uh, having you and interacting with you online. Please remember to follow her on her social media, her YouTube. She is Caro, your health coach. Your health coach yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Remember to subscribe and follow Caro, your health coach. And also, if you haven't subscribed to Shared Moments with Justice, please, I can imagine you're doing us injustice. So go and subscribe to Shared Moments with Justice. We are on our journey to 100K subscribers. Your one subscription might be the, the one that will get us there. So Asante Sana, it's been such a pleasure. And I look forward to meeting you again next time. I am Esther Josephine.